Okay, a couple quick things to the newscast that I've been hearing on the news today. Those, there are these monks in Burma who are doing a public protesting, like walking through the streets and um, trying to get people to um, not go for the government in there because of some thing that the government are doing. They say they want to make a democracy in Burma, but they're obviously moving to something that is far from democracy. And so they're... These monks have been lining up and protesting by walking or blocking. That's all I heard about, like, walking along streets. And um, people have, like, spectators, like, supporters of them have been making human link chains to protect them from, I don't know what, I don't know, haters or something. And um, the government has been, like, doing these outbursts or something against them. They did a couple of things with, like, they, they, they had people who were in jail who were helping the monks put back into jail because of helping the monks like like for false charges and it ticked the monks off and the monk supporters and so they went back to protesting more and so we don't know if there's going to be a big revolution or not in Burma but um who knows that's just one of the things I heard in the news today the other one is these Chinese hackers doing hack attacks so isn't that catchy now folks hack attacks Never mind. And so they're worrying about people in China or Chinese people. There could be people in China that aren't Chinese or people, set of people that make it look like Chinese people are hacking the government. Like people in the Pentagon have been hacked already and their files have been put on spyware and taken with, um, sorry, I thought someone was the window, taken with like having spyware and downloading all their files from the computer to the persons in China and so they're wondering if Chinese people are trying to sneak stuff from the government and the US is obviously opposed to this idea and they think that obviously that they obviously think not thinking obviously they obviously think that Chinese people are hacking for government secrets and they want to start a hack war a hack war and the Chinese people have had a lot of trouble with hacking in the past, not hacking, but hacking, and so they're kind of playing. Why would I want to do that? We've had our trouble. Blah, blah, blah. I can't stand it anymore. You blame us. Stuff like that, and um, U.S. is saying, meh, 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 meh. "You always say this. You guys have always been doing this." Blah, blah, blah. And so there's a big controversy over that. I just heard the news because. There's any Chinese people hacking out there. Hack for the good of justice, not for the good of Bush. You can hack Bush. We'd all like to see what it's on his iPod and his iTunes. And we'd all like to see what websites he actually goes to. If he actually goes to any sites. If he can, actually. Probably says he can, but he has his secretary advice go to him. Go for him. Do all that kind of stuff. wonder if there's a... Webs... Uh, Bush should have a weblog. Bush should do this. Bush should have a weblog. And he should post in his weblog things I did today. I ate a bean burrito. It was good and it had cheese in it. Today I talked to Condoleezza Rice. She seemed very annoyed and I could smell her perfume. She put a little too much on. Hi, I'm Dick Cheney. I'm kind of sticky in here on Bush's computer. And did you see the guy's face when he choked on that pretzel? Oh my god, that was so fun. Even though it was a while ago, it's, it still cracks me when I really think about it. <laughs> Enough of my ill-witted humor. So that's when I heard the news. Newscast over. I will cut sometimes report on the news like this. On an outdoor piece of paper. Enough talk about that. Don't want to hear no people dying, but people die every day, so you can't not hear about it. Sorry. I stare too much, don't I?